Welcome to STEM Professionals. In this video, we will discuss the problems and conceptual exercises of Chapter 2 from the book James S. Walker. So let's start with the video. Now here in this question, we are given that in the year 1992, a severe storm near Aleutian Island caused a cargo ship to spill 29,000 rubber ducks and some other stuff. Now, 10 months after the incident, the rubber duck began to appear along the shoreline near Alaska, which is roughly 1600 miles away. Now, we have to calculate the approximate average speed of the ocean current that carried the duck to the shore. Now we have to write the answer in meter per second and in miles per hour. Now the given data we have is uh, the time it took is 10 months and the distance they covered is and uh, this is 1600 miles. Now average speed we know it is the distance covered divided by the time elapsed. So distance covered we have 1600 miles and time elapsed we have 10 months now we can convert the units so 1 mile it means uh, 1609 meter and in one month we have 30 days now days into seconds so in one day we have uh, 8.64 times 10 to the power 4 seconds so here we can see that this mile and mile will cancel month month days and days so we'll get the answer in meter per second so this would be approximately 0 0.099 meter per second so this would be the answer for the a part now in the B part, we have to write the answer in miles per hour. So speed would be equals to 1600. This is already in miles divided by time is 10 months. Now we have to convert this months into hour. This would be, um, we have to convert the units. So in one month, we have uh, 30 days. And in one day, we have 24 hours. So this would be equals to 0 0.22 miles per hour. So this would be the answer for the B part. Now here in this question we are given that on a dark and stormy night you saw a flash of lightning and 6.5 seconds later you hear the thunder. Now speed of sound in air is about 340 meters per second. Now we have to calculate how far away was the lightning bolt. Now we know that sound wave propagates in a straight line from thunderbolt to your ears. So that it is a straight line, something like that. And we have to calculate this distance D. Speed is given to be 340 meters per second and time it uh, took to cover this much of distance is 6.5 seconds now we can easily solve this problem we know that speed is distance over elapsed time and from here distance would be equals to speed into time so speed we have uh, 340 meter per second and time is 6.5 seconds so from here we'll get the answer to be 2.2 times 10 to the power 3 meter now if you wish to write the answer in kilometer this would be 2.2 kilometer so this is the answer for this question now here in this question we are given that a finch rides on the back of tortoise who walks at a speed s1 is 0 0.060 meter per second this is speed for tortoise and after 1.5 minutes that means the finch rides on the back of tortoise for 1.5 minutes so let t1 be 1.5 minutes now after this much time period the finch takes the flight in the same direction 
with the speed 11 meter per second and time is uh, 1.5 minutes so t2 is 1.5 minutes and s2 that is the speed of finch we have 11 meters per second now we have to calculate the average speed of the finch for this three minute time interval so to calculate the average uh, speed we'll first calculate the distance it covered so d would be equals to d1 plus d2 now d1 is the distance which it covered on the back of tortoise so this would be equals to speed of tortoise multiplied with time so speed we have 0, 0.0 uh, this is sorry 0 0.060 meter per second multiplied with time is 1.5 minutes now we can convert it into seconds by multiplying it with 60 so this much of uh, time in seconds now plus d2 so d2 is a distance which it covered alone which was uh, with the speed 11 point 11 meters per second so this would be 11 meter per second multiplied with time we have uh, this is uh, 1.5 minutes so multiplied with 60 to convert it into uh, seconds so from here the total distance it covered uh, comes out to be as nearly 995 meters now we can easily calculate the average speed so average speed is the distance covered divided by the elapsed time t distance covered is 995 meter and elapsed time we have uh, 1.5 minutes here and 1.5 minutes here so total 3 minutes multiplied with 60 to convert it into seconds so this would be equals to 5.5 meter per second this would be the answer for the given question so here in this question we are given that a dog continuously run back and forth between its two owners who are walking towards one another with speed 1.3 meter per second now the dog started running when the owners were 8.2 meter apart and we have to calculate the distance traveled by dog when the owners meet now since the owner are traveling at constant speed 1.3 meter per second and initially the distance was 8.2 meter between the honors so they will meet in the middle this would cover a distance of uh, 4.1 meter and similarly this will cover this uh, honor will cover a distance of 4.1 meter now the way I'll uh, proceed with this question will be first we'll find the time that will elapse before the owner meet each other so, owner meet each other in the middle now the speed for this owner is 1.3 meter you can calculate from this side also or from this side also it's one and the same thing so speed we are given to be 1.3 meter per second and distance traveled by this owner will be 4.1 meter so this is 4.1 meter now from here we can easily calculate the time taken by this owner to reach in the middle at this position so this would be uh, equals to distance divided by speed distance is 4.1 meter and speed is 1.3 meter per second so this would be equals to 3.15 seconds so this is the time elapsed when uh, two owners meet now for this time interval the dog is running back and forth between the owners so distance traveled would be for the dog this would be equals to speed multiplied with the times elapsed speed for the dog is uh, 2.7 meter per second so this is 2.7 meter per second multiplied with time is 3.15 second so this is equals to 8.5 meter this is the distance traveled by the dog when the two owners meet now here in this question we are given that blood flows through a major artery and a smaller artery now the speed uh, in the major artery is 1 meter per second and it flows through a distance of 0 0.5 meter now in smaller artery the speed is 0 0.6 meter per second and it flows for a distance of 
uh, 0.5 meter. Now we have to determine is the average speed of blood equals to 0.8 meter per second or greater than 0.8 meter per second or less than this number. Now we see that the distance uh, interval in the major artery also and in the smaller artery is same that is 0.5 meter per second but the time interval will be different because in case of smaller artery it flows at a rate 0.6 meter per second so this uh, in the smaller artery it will uh, flow for a larger period that means t would be more here and in this case t would be less why because speed is more and distance is same now because the time spent is more in the smaller artery so average speed should be less than 0 0.8 meter per second so we can write that average speed will be less than 0 0.8 meter per second now in the b part we have to verify the part a that is we have to calculate the average speed and we'll see that is it less than 0.8 or not now average speed we know it is equals to total distance let this distance be d1 let this distance be d2 so total distance would be d1 plus d2 divide by total time so here time is let this be t1 let this be t2 so this is t1 plus t2 so this would be equals to now d1 plus d2 is 1 meter okay so 1 meter now time t1 now time t1 can be written as we know that time is distance over speed so t1 can be written as d1 over s1 plus this would be d2 over s2 we can write this way now we can simply put the values so this is 1 meter divide by now d1 is 0 0.8 0 0.5 meter so 0 0.5 divide by s1 now s1 we are given this is s1 and this is s2 so speed is 1 meter so this is 0 0.5 divided by 1 and this would d2 is also 0 0.5 so 0 0.5 divided by s2 is 0 0.6 so this would be 0 0.6 now we can solve this and we will get the answer to be 0 0.75 meter per second which is less than 0 0.8 meter per second therefore we have verified that the speed the average speed is less than 0 0.8 meter per second <laughs>